Hello there. Today's topic is regarding the transfer of water to rooftop tanks in high-rise buildings. Conventionally, all water transfer systems are designed with constant speed pumps that utilize level switches or float switches in the tanks that have to be filled or the rooftop tanks in this case. However, with the modernization of technology, there are clear benefits of utilizing variable speed pumps for the purposes of water transfer to these rooftop tanks. Let's have a look at some of these advantages. So typically, in a lot of high-rise buildings, we will have a break tank in the basement, which is where the water mains delivers its water. And the requirement is to transfer the water from this break tank to this rooftop tank. In this case, we use fixed speed pumps that go from 0 to 100% speed in a few seconds and also when stopping off, when the tanks or the roof are filled, they go from 100 to 0% speed very suddenly. This leads to a very high amount of water hammering, noise, vibration and increased wear and tear. This is why for buildings that are greater than 60 meters in height, we recommend the utilization of variable speed driven pumps that introduce a slow start and a slow stop. It is important to note that soft starters are not adequate for this application because while they may start up the pump softly in the stop down, which is where a lot of the hammering effects occur, they don't have any special, special benefit. In this case, in the rooftop tank, there are some additional requirements. We need to use the solenoid valves or delayed action float valves. These valves help create a pressure drop in this line because in this case, the pressure boosting system will work on a pressure control, not on a level control, which means that when the line starts to empty because of the opening of this valve, the pressure in the line will drop, indicating the pump to increase its speed and ramp up slowly. And the same way when the tank is filled, the ramp down of the pump will occur slowly. Please note that in this application, even though variable speed pumps are used, there is no requirement of a pressure vessel or a diaphragm tank. Just to conclude, for any buildings above 60 meters, we recommend the use of variable speed water transfer systems as they help in reducing and protecting the system against water hammering, noise from the flow of water in the pipes, vibrations that actually cause a lot of damage to all the joints in the system, as well as the excessive wear and tear that comes from the sudden ramp up and sudden ramp down.